what's up guys my name is number one pred and today what I'll be bringing you guys is my 2000 subscribers setup video as I did promise in my thank you for 2000 subscribers video and uh, once again I give you guys a massive thank you for 2k obviously that does mean a lot to me but um, into the video I'm going to go straight to my setup which is actually here and here is like an overview stroke long shot of my actual gaming setup um, it does go across to like desks or whatever and uh, I'm going to go into each individual part of the uh, setup um, in detail and stuff like that so you guys know exactly what I'm doing and what I use them for and how I rate them so I'm going to start off with my PC itself this is an LG custom built uh, computer I don't exactly know all the inv individual parts because I wasn't the one who actually purchased it it was actually a present for my uh, birthday and Christmas combined so um don't know too much about it, all I know is that it runs fine, it doesn't run perfectly, it isn't the fastest and um, isn't the strongest, I, yeah, I don't really use it for gaming on it, like my, well, not Minecraft, but like Battlefield, stuff like that, um, I don't PC game, so it's alright for me, I don't really mind, it renders okay and um, just does its job to be honest, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, here's the uh, headset I use for my commentaries, this, bear in mind this actually used to be my old um, gaming headset but um, the problem with this is that it I accidentally ran over it with the wheels on my chair and it broke the chat um, mic thing uh, not this but the cable that goes into the controller um, so obviously I can't talk couldn't talk to people so I had to purchase a new one which is over there which I'll go into in a little bit but um, it still works with commentaries and stuff like that so that's what I use it for for now hopefully I'll be able to get like a snowball or whatever which I was hope hoping to get already but um, I didn't really have much, you know, I, I don't know, I just didn't, wasn't in the mood, couldn't be bothered to buy it, in other words, so yeah, um, that's that for that, here's my PC monitor, it's not even good, honestly, this is only temporal, um, I did have a, like a better monitor which came with this as it was all custom built, all the, this key, uh, keyboard and mouse that came with that, they're both wireless by the way, but the monitor, um, this is only temporal, it's literally like a square, it sucks, um, it's really small, but um, hopefully I'll be able to purchase a new one soon. That's a lot better than this, and um, it works. I mean, but it just doesn't work very well. It works, like works, works, but I don't really like it. Is what I'm trying to say. So uh, hopefully I'll be able to purchase a new one. But yeah, that's that for that. Um, for my actual game capture, this is my Roxio Game Cap HD Pro, which is what I do actually use to record my gameplays. And uh, very good, obviously, HD quality, 1080p or 720p. Either one is completely fine, does its job, I'm really happy with it. Simple to use as well. And um, that's for that. Here's my TV monitor. Um, it's a 23-inch Samsung LED monitor screen. Um, perfect size, in my opinion, for gaming. I'd say the range from the best monitors you can buy in terms of size probably be from 19 inch to about 24 or 25 inches um, just so you can like get full view of the screen without having to like turn your like head around just to see like the whole screen which is kind of annoying I remember doing that on my 42 inch uh, TV screen in the front room uh, living room when I didn't take gaming so seriously but uh, that's that for that perfect it's got really good response time as well here's my headset um, it is a Turtle Beach PX22. Um, PX meaning they it works for both of the consoles, meaning PlayStation and Xbox. So um, that's really good. It's got like a triple bass boost as well as a single, which is obviously good. Um, under here is my, are my consoles, which I'll move my chair a second and uh, turn the light on because um, it's a bit dark down there. All right. So here's my PlayStation 4 console, which is obviously a new buy. Um, my controller is just the regular one that came with the console, obviously. It's got the nice little touch pad, which is kind of a cool addition to the controller. Um, really good console, I love it, obviously. Um, here's my Xbox, just a little bit underneath. Um, 360 with a 60 gigabyte hard drive. It was a premium, what from what I believe, when it was in its prime. So um, it's a really, really good console. Obviously, it's lasted me about four and a half years, so I'm really happy 
that it has lasted me so long. I actually say it's lasted, it's lasted five years in fact, which is even better. So, um, that's that. And here is my 360 controller, no scuff, it's just the regular um, black wired controller. Uh, does its job. I don't really want to scuff now, obviously, since I've got this. I might. I don't know if you can even get scuff for PS4. I'm pretty sure you can, but um, I'll have to have a look into that um, sometime in the near future. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for the setup. Um, just going to show you my chair as well, because people want to know what I sit on. You don't really want to be sitting on one of those, you know, kitchen chairs. You want to be, you know, mobile on it so you can spin around and move around as well, because it's got the wheels on it so I can move from the computer to their, you know, Xbox. So it's kind of cool, even though there's not really much uh, movement needed to go from the computer to Xbox. But yeah, that's basically it for the uh, um, the chair. Um, if because it's rock hard down there when you sit on it for a long time. What I tend to do is a nice tip for you guys is to you know put a cushion on there and um, your butt will be as comfy as ever. So that's pretty much it for the video. I'll give you, know, you guys one more you know long shot of the actual setup. Make sure to drop a like for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Can we try and hit 50 likes on this setup video? That'd be absolutely crazy if we can. But yeah, that's basically it for the video. Have an awesome day, guys. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.